Hi everybody, this video is to learn the number of beats that each of the notes and rests get and you should have page 23 in your workbook available. If you have it open and you have already done so in class, you will have the names of each of the notes and rests already written in to the right of each of the symbols and we talked about in the first video or in class that each of the notes has a partner rest and we're really only memorizing five different first names and then identifying whether or not it is a note because it has the round tummy or note head uh, or is it a rest because it comes in all kinds of different shapes so whole half quarter eight and sixteen are the names now uh, both of the partners will have the same number of beats as well and you should write the numbers of beats next to on the left side of the symbol um, right next to them so we're going to start with whole whole notes have four beats of sound and whole rests have four beats of silence make sure that you have those written in now when we play them in class as we don't necessarily have instruments to pass out each time we're going to pretend to make sound when we play the whole note by coming together and clapping our hands and then counting, bouncing one and two and three and four and. And when we do the rest, we're going to pretend to go away from making sound. So we will say rest and two and three and four and. Half notes get two beats of sound and half rests, two beats of silence. Make sure that you have the two written to the left of the symbols. And then again, if we play a half note in class, we will clap and hold for one and two and. If we play a half rest in class, we will go away from making sound rest and two and. Quarter notes receive one beat the note is played for one beat of sound and the rest one beat of silence. When we play those in class, we will clap once for the one sound played for one beat. One and. One and. When we play the rest, we will go away from making sound for one beat. Rest and. Rest and. Eighth notes get one half of a beat's worth of sound. In other words, played for one half of a beat. Eighth rests, one half of a beat of silence. Sixteenth notes, one fourth of a beat. Sixteenth rests, one fourth of a beat. Make sure that you very neatly have written in all of the numbers of beats that each of the symbols receives and then look at the patterns to help you memorize. First, the names, whole, half, quarter, eight, sixteen. Now the beats, four, two, one, one half, one fourth. If you notice that there's a mathematical pattern, as each of the notes and rests goes down in size, so does the number of beats that they get. So, whole is four, cut it in half is two, cut that in half, they get one quarter notes. Cut one in half, equals a half and if you cut a half and half you get one fourth four two one one half one fourth memorize that little pattern with whole half quarter eight sixteen four two one one half one fourth and you have all the most important aspects of what we need to memorize already in your head now the whole purpose of this is that we can actually read and play music so Let's see if we can try to read this. Hopefully you can see that fairly well. We have a whole note which gets four beats, two half notes that equal two beats. So two plus two is four. Remember, the top number in the time signature tells you how many beats can be in a measure. Not really tells you how many can be, have to be. So two plus two is four. Half rest two beats, quarter notes, one each. Two plus one plus one is four. Each one of these, a quarter note, a quarter rest, a quarter note, and a quarter rest, 
are getting one beat. Put them all together in the measure, you have four. How we're going to play them? With our hands. I'm going to do a mini version of what we do in class. You try to do it along with me. One and two and ready and play. And one and two and three and four. And one and two and one and two and rest and two and one and one. One and rest and one and rest and. Let's try it again now that you get how this goes. Say the numbers out loud with me and practice reading music and playing it along with me. One and two and ready and play and one and two and three and four and one and two and one and two and rest and two and one and one and one and rest and one and rest and try that yourself a few times maybe even make your own create your own little song I'll show you the tricks for how to do the half of a beat eighth note and eighth rest and fourth of a beat sixteenth note and sixteenth rest the next time that we're in class have a nice day everybody